Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Purple Shine. Last episode we made our way to Crowsville. We took down Team Rocket twice, we got Fly, and our rival gave us one of the best items ever, we can forget move. So all the HMs we teach our Pokemon that we have to for the you know time being, we can get rid of right away, which is great. Today we're gonna go get the fourth gym badge. Hopefully it's not too difficult. We also caught a Murkrow and we evolved our Monferno, so now we got an Infernape. Our team's looking pretty badass. So can we go to the department store now? We can. Ooh, okay. Now that we can do this, let's see if we can buy some items or some stones. We want a shiny stone and we want, if this in the game, like a link cable or something to evolve um, our Carablast. I need to find out what you need to evolve Haunchcrow with as well, or Murkrow, because I honestly cannot remember. But you just sell some standard items there. Alrighty then, let's go up to the next floor. Right, what do you sell? Is that an ability capsule, I think? No, I think it's translated, so it's uh, kind of hard to tell. Uh, let's go to you. Aha! Right, so. We get the shiny stone. Was it Dawnstone? No, it's shiny stone for Roselia, definitely. There is no, like, link cable or anything like that, so I'm not too sure how we're going to get a, a Scavalier. We've been lucky it might just be a level up in this game. But let's evolve this uh, Roselia now. Let's get Rose Raid. I'm really hoping we can get a Scavalier because I really fancy using one. I kind of like the Pokemon. I think it's really cool. But it's just so annoying to get because you obviously need to trade and in fan games, ROM hacks, it's uh, yeah, kind of annoying. Even with like the main series games, it's kind of annoying to set up anyway, trying to find a trade like that. There we go. Got a Roserade. Our team looking a little bit better. Right, let me quickly see what we need to get a Haunch Crow as well, because, like I said, I cannot remember. But we'll quickly check the other floors as well. Okay, there's some good stuff we can get. Yeah, I was going to say, probably going to sell the vitamins up here. You'll probably have the X items. Yep. Alright, let's make our way to the top floor. And anything up here? It's not translated, unfortunately. Sad. Don't know what they want. But, uh, yeah, let me just quickly check, make sure we can pick something up. Okay, it's a good thing I looked because Murkrow is with the Dusk Stone. So let's get that bad boy. Nice. Okay. I don't think we should evolve Haunchcrow, well, uh, Murkrow just yet. I'll get a few more levels first. And then, uh, yeah, we'll evolve it. So let's go take on the fourth gym. Not sure what type of the gym's going to be. Hopefully something easy we can beat. I mean, lots of Murkrows around here, and I'm assuming it's maybe Dark type? Uh, let's find out. Greetings, young trainer. If you want advice on how to beat this gym, memorize the route you're taking on your... or your risk getting lost more than once. Oh, dude, I hate this. Oh, I hate this so much. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was one of the ones you have to, like walk across a hidden path and you can fall off and you gotta keep redoing it. I hate them puzzles so much. Oh, Alright. So the fact you got a Mighty in it, it's definitely gotta be a, a dark type gym, which for us should be easy. Should. <laughs> Ooh, you actually take a lot of damage. Let's go into a Fern Ape. Bit a lot safer. Just go Mock Punch. Nice. Sharpedo. Uh, gonna go back into Murkrow. Do a little bit of Switch Train on the way. And then Mega Drain. Nice, got the HP back. <laughs> Alright. Uh oh. oh you can fall. Oh, that's the worst. Right. Up we go. Oh. So watch your step or you'll find yourself in front of the entrance at breakneck speed. Yep. Already figured that out. <laughs> uh, let's go into a Fernate muck puncher, because yeah, you'll super die. Rawdon. So we'll go into Murkrow, into Rose Raid, Mega Drain ya. Nice, nice, nice. And Umbreon, back into Murkrow again. And then back into Infernape, then we'll just go for a close combat. Oh, you're going for a Protect. Toxic Protect is the worst. <laughs> Alright. Uh... Oh, no. Right, so we go... Let's get healed up. Oh, it's too late now. So you go up at one point, 
Then we go right. Go down. And you fall down, okay. Oh, this gym sucks. This <laughs> gym sucks so much. Oh, they're the worst. I always say I like puzzles. You know, I love... Oh, item there. I love puzzles in Pokemon games. I take it back. <laughs> These are the one puzzles I do not like. They are just super annoying. Oh, man. Alright. I'm going to try and let you guys know as well which way I'm going. So we're going to go right. Up. Wait, nope. Left. Can I go right? I can't go right. So left. Up. Left. Up. Up. There you go. Can't go left. So right. Right. Up. Right. I think this is down at one point. So right down. I'm going to keep trying to go right. Down and right I'm going. Oh, okay. So it's down and right. If you beat me, I'll give you a clue to keep moving forward. Oh, thank you. Really much like that. If I can get a bug buzz off, you're super dead, but I don't think I can. Oh yeah, it's beating me. That sucks. If we can just avoid this Carablast, man, everything will be good. Get through the confusion. No! No, I hurt myself twice. Are you kidding me? I hate confusion so much. Nightshade, uh... I'm good. Absol, might as well stay in. Just spark you. And spark you. The worst thing is I have to go and get healed up soon as well. So I'm going to keep going right and up here. Okay. Hint at end. So let's go right. Right and up. Let's go left. Left. Right. I think we're almost there. Without bragging, I am the best trainer in this gym. Okay. I'll be the last one in this gym. I wonder if I can take you out. Just need a little bit of a difference. Oh, you're going for superpower. You suck. Man. Alright, so now it's just going to be left up. Hey, we did it. But I need to get healed up. So, um, yeah, let's get healed up and then I'll try and run for it again. So in case you're playing this game as well and you want to kind of know the way to do it, I will... Tell you which way I'm going. Just trying to get back to the Pokemon every time is... Oh, a little bit of a maze. Alright. I think as well for this fight, we'll lead off with Carablast in case we can get Bug Buzz off right away. Maybe even Fury Cutter. I do like me a Fury Cutter. Alright, so Jim is up here. I keep thinking the Jim is like a little bit further down every time. Right, so we go up. You go left. So, up. And keep going left and up until you can go up. Okay. And from here, when you hit the wall, you keep going right and up. And then you're going to go down and right. And then you're going to keep going right. And we're going to try and go up. Right a bit. Right a bit up. And then you go left. And then up. There you go. That wasn't too bad, to be honest. Not too bad. Right, let me save it in case something bad happens. Let's try this gym. So welcome, young man. I am Artemis, uh, the greatest dark type Pokemon trainer. It's up to you if you want to challenge me, but you, but can you accept defeat? Can you accept defeat? Because I've got a great team for dark types. I think. The last few gyms have been very difficult, so... Oh, of course, you've got a Haunch Crow to lead off with. Oh, man. I guess we switch. Just want to try and get the Fury Cutter going, but Haunch Crow just makes things very difficult. Alright, Night Slash, that's fine. So now let's go Spark. I think we can probably one shot Haunch Crow, surely. Nice! Good job! Alright, not off to a bad start. Sweet. A level 37 for Luxray as well. Tyranitar. That is fine. We will close combat you, absolutely. Level 34, wow. 
So yeah, I feel only slightly over leveled for some of our Pokemon, which the other Pokemon make me feel under leveled. So I feel like I'm a good level right now. Nice! Yeah, Taranta did not stand a chance against Infernape. <laughs> Alright, two more to go. I feel like you might have a Mega, because the admin we battled uh, last episode had a Mega Pinsir. So, as a chance, Crocodile, uh, I'm going to stay in, and I'm going to go for another close combat. All that Intimidate kind of sucks. Right, come on, close combat. Big damage. Big damage. Nice. Woo! <laughs> I really thought with the Intimidate, you might just live. What's your last one? Shiftery. Oh, cool. You know what? Another close combat. And we win. Easy. <laughs> yes. After how difficult the last gym was, it feels good to have like an easy gym. Oh my goodness. So you've earned your reward for this gym. Here's the Night Badge. Woo. So Night Badge will make Pokemon below level 50 obey you. Additionally, HM Strength can be used outside of battle. So can we not use Fly then still? I really want to be able to fly. I'm going to double check. So let me um, teach Murkrow Fly now. Uh, that's my TM case. Alright, you can learn Fly. Let's get rid of Haze. Can we fly? Oh, we can! I thought we might need a HM. That's good. So now, uh, let me just save the game in case something bad happens. I want to just get healed up. Now we've defeated the third gym leader, we can go and talk to this guy. Get the bike. So I already beat the gym leader, so can I have my bike please? Oh, not translated, but bike. Hey, we've got the scooter. Sweet, so now that we've got this, can I actually use the Arcanine? No, I can't, but can I use the scooter? Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, that's actually kind of sick. Oh, this is so awesome. All right, uh, let's fly. And we are going to go back over here. Back to Crows. Actually, no, before I forget, let's fly down to here and then we can go and use the lottery get another egg because it could be any Pokemon out of 300 species so uh, let's hope we get a rare egg and that could be our sixth team member or it could be something we box who knows right with that let's yeah keep our team as it is and continue on and I guess we just keep heading do we want to head west so that's route 9, that's route 8, do we want to go down here, or do we want to go this way? I feel like logically we want to go down to route 8, right? Because the last route we went down was route 7. So I say let's go check out route 8, and if it's the wrong way then it's the wrong way. At least we can just maybe find some stuff. Uh, yo, how's it going? I know we look silly standing around like this. A little bit, yeah. Uh, let's go into Rose Raid. Sludge Bomb ya. Nice. Back into Murkrow. Go into Infernape. Switch training sucks. I wish we could get XP share at some point. XP share would be so clutch. Oh, there's an item over there. Oh, Poker Flute. That's good, because then I... Is that actually like a item or a key item? I know what the Snorlax is, so we can go and um, wake it up and see what's on the other side, because I think it was blocking some items. There's a few things we can do, which is going to be good. Uh, Nido Queen. Oh, I hate Nido Queen so much. Just keep going. Nice. It wasn't too bad. Not too bad. So this is a daycare, We've got another daycare. Okay then, uh, what else do we want to do? Uh, yo! The die is cast. 
Okay. Let's go Fury Cutter, Fury Cutter. Keep Fury Cutter in. Let's go. Oh, when you get the Fury Cutter off, man, it's so sick. I don't know what that is, but okay. Lucky Egg? No. That's the, um... I also, is that for Chansey? Certain species of Pokemon, it says there. I don't think that's Lucky Egg. Lucky Egg would have been so clutch, though. Uh, let's switch into Infernape. Ooh, close combat, yeah. Because I haven't flies. Oh, it opens up so much for us now, which is so good. Uh, yo, I'm training here until I'm strong enough to get to the volcano. Okay, that's nice. We also need to see if we can find strength somewhere, because we can now use it. But we don't have strength. Kaleido, let's go. Rose Raid. But our team's just looking banging now. I was saying, like, at the start of this game. It's, one of them, it's probably one of them games where, like, we're going to struggle at the start, but once we get our team and they start evolving, we're going to be destroying everyone and everything. So this is the Poke Mountain. You know that enormous Pokemon who only sleeps and eats? I met one of my travels. Love to see it again. If you can get some data on it using the Pokedex, I'll give you a little gift. Oh, okay. So before we go, do, uh, go up there, let's go and do that then. Because if we fly to... Is it better to go here? I think it's better to, no. I think, yeah, I think it's better to go from here. Let me get healed up. I think this is the better way to go from. Right, so up we go. Although, now this is a swamp, I'm starting to think it might not be the best way. I mean, the swamp isn't that big to be fair, so. And we defeat all the trainers, there's not many patches of grass. We'll get through this pretty quick. So I think it's definitely this route. Snorlax is there. Use the poker flute. Nice. He's in a bad mood. He attacks you. Bring it on, Snorlax. What are you going to do, mate? Nothing. Because I can close combat you. So we've got the data on Snorlax now. I had to catch it. If I had to catch it, that's going to suck. Can I get to this dude? Oh, I need Surf to get to him. That sucks. Right, uh, anyway. Uh, I'm going to fly... back over here. Actually, there's something else we can maybe do. I think it was this dude up here. An old man somewhere. Uh, should be around here somewhere. This guy. Find the wind turbine among the cattle. I feel like... There was a ranch? Maybe over there? Wasn't there like a... Place over here. Peaceful woods, rocky path. That's going to be a pain in the butt to try and do. Because I think there's like a few different locations it could be. But I think we'll probably... For that treasure hunt, I think I'm going to wait till we get near the end of the game. And we've got all the locations unlocked. Because trying to like remember these like clues from... You know, if we do this clue now, then we get another clue and we can't do it for a while. Trying to remember it's going to suck. But if we just do it all at once at the end, we can just go around clue after clue. That's going to be good. Unless we come across it you know, in the future, then, yeah, I might as well just do it. We'll see. But let's go and talk to you. Oh, there you go. That's Snorlax, the Pokemon I was telling you about. Thanks for showing me the data. As promised, I'm giving you the reward. Oh, that's how you get strength. Sweet. So we had to do that. That was, that was lucky. This cable car takes you to Pokemon Mountain. Let's go. Ooh. I'm super happy I did that. Uh, hi. Hi, my name is Antoine. Uh, my passion is flying with my Pidgeot in the sky, the wind on my face, being able to touch the clouds, breathe in pure air. Can't think of anything better. Would you like to give it a try? If you pass the course, I'll give you one of my Pidgeot. Sure. 
Oh, this is sick. Let me explain this uh, swap blue form gates. The goal is to pass through them in a specific order. I'll show you first, and then you'll have to do it as I did. Let's get started. Okay. This is really cool. Oh, the mountains look sick in the background as well. So we've just got to get through the swap blue. Okay. Uh. Oh, dude. There's so many. Okay, it's just that one little loop we have to do. Oh, I'll try and remember this. There we go, we did it! Oh my goodness, that was so annoying, that took so long. But we got a Pidgeot! Nice, okay. Take good care of my Pokemon. Come on, let's go back. Oh my goodness, alright. And I need to teach someone strength, don't I, for this. Oh, who am I going to teach strength to? Uh, I don't know. <sighs> it's gonna have to be Luxray. For now, but well, we can get rid of it. Obviously, because we've got the... Uh, the HM remover, which is so good. Let's move this out of the way. Alright, so we got Camera Megastone. Cool. So there's two ways to go through. This one takes us to Volcano. <gasps> hey, Mazzy Arcanine! That's why uh, we couldn't ride the Arcanine before. And now we can. I thought I could ride the Arcanine wherever I wanted. But it's only in here, so. Where does the other one take us? So let's quickly go back. Oh, I want to keep running the Arcanine, man. It's so good. For Frost Path. So, which way do I want to go? Poke Mountain. Route 8 Mount Dragon. I don't... Poke Mountain has to go for Ice Cave. I think. We'll go through this way first. And then we'll go for the Volcano later. Because I feel like this way is probably the way to go. Because otherwise you have to spend the 20k to get the Arcanine. And not everyone's probably going to would have done that. We did it because it sounded awesome. But. Ah, Poke Mountain. That was easy to get to. Okay. City where snowflakes fall day or night. Right, okay. That's good. So we can explore this place first and then we can go through the volcano bit. Is there a gym here in Poke Mountain or anything? I think I saw a gigantic bird silhouette fly over the sky. I wonder if it was a Pokemon. Maybe. Uh, it's rumored that a legendary Pokemon can be found in the ice cave, which is crazy. It's crazy, dude. Uh, anything else around here? There's another cave. So this is the entrance to Ice Cave. Oh, did not mean to do that, but it's fine. Uh, let's go check out this house. If you can cross the volcano on Poker Mountain, you'll reach Dragon Mountain. Oh, okay. Oh, Articuno's there. And it's gone. <laughs> well then, I guess that's the legendary they were talking about. Poker Mountain is actually built on the side of a volcano. Seems unbelievable, but it is. I know, I went into it a little bit. So we've got Ice Cave. Should we go through here? Oh, Team Rocket here. Well then, um... Okay, that's fine. So this cave is under the control. Team Rocket, get out of here! How about new? You get out of here. 
So I think once we deal with Team Rocket here, we'll go through the volcano and go through the, uh, get to that dragon mountain. That sounds sick. Hey, oh, so I'm really cold. I'm going to warm up by giving you a beating. I mean, you can try. Ooh, let's go into Rose Raid. Mega Drain ya. No, don't hurt yourself in confusion. Nice, snapped out of it. And you get all the HP back. Oh, dude, I love Mega Drain. So sick. Uh, this is going to be a pain in the butt to beat, so I'm just going to go. Nope, did not want to do that. Minute of Rock Punch. There you go. Nice. Having a nice water type for the team could be really good. If we can get like a, a wall rain, a water ice would be sick, or a dugong. But hey you, how did you manage to get past the other henchmen? I killed them. <laughs> I just beat them because they were easy, they were weak. Just like you, my dude. Just like you. Nothing compared to me. Slash, uh, let's get rid of the headbutt. Mm, if I go like this. Nice. Wait, easy peasy. So what's with these grunts letting anyone pass through? I know, right? They're just they're terrible at their job. You though, you'll never let that happen, right? Oh, we'll see about that. <laughs> oh, weeping bell. I guess the last one's gonna be a victory bell. Yep, but no victory for you. More like loser bell. <laughs> So stop right there, you won't go any further. Yeah, we'll see about that. That's what like the last 20 million people have been saying to me recently. And you know what happens? They all just get destroyed. Honestly. Nice. Right, what are we doing? I feel like I gotta make sure I don't fall down the gap. Uh okay. If I ever go up, that takes me down a gap. So I'm going to go down this way. No, that's dead end. Okay. Ooh, okay, okay. It's back the way I came. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, I think I want to get onto that. Which we've done. Nice. We're looking for the rare Pokemon of this cave. We wanted you to get in our way. Okay, I wonder what's gonna be. Can't be Articuno, right? I, th I feel like Articuno living in a cave is weird. I guess it does live in Seafoam Islands, but. Yeah, to me, just, I feel like the flying Pokemon should live in a place where they can just easily fly out of and not in a cave. Like, you know, as far as Pokemon doesn't make complete sense all the time, does it? <laughs> uh, Burnett. Just keep fleeing wheeling. Good. And fun up so good, man. Oh, hi. So we're moving forward. Okay. I might be able to take you out. Take that back. I'm definitely not taking you out. Spark finish you off. Nice. Woo. Oh. About to get to the end there, but I'm gonna stop you, you'll see. But I'll make sure we'll get healed up after this fight, because whatever we're going to go against, I would like to go into it as healthy as possible. But with how strong our team is right well, I say a team. If Burnape is right now, I don't think I'm going to lose. <laughs> right, uh, do 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 do, let's... Oh, I don't have any... Oh, I've got Antidote, yeah. I thought it was Paralyzed Hill for a second. I've got one potion. I'm going to do it on Infernape, because I've got a Hyper Potion somewhere, I know I do. Yeah. On to you. Let's do this. You see? There's nothing. We better leave. There's no trace of legendary here. Hey, you. Me? What the hell are you doing here? I'm just passing through. It's nice here. He's just messing with us. We'll show him. Yeah, come on, you grunts. Only one Pokemon? You think one is enough to take me out? Oh, big mistake. <laughs> Next two, please. You're a loser. Leave it to me. He's probably not trying to do a three on one. Even then, I don't think you'll stand a chance. Sick. Persian. Ooh, have all the normal types, please. Last one. I'm ashamed of you. <laughs> I'll take care of it. Alright, bring it on. Crobat. 
going to Luxray and we'll just uh, spark you. To be fair, that Crobat did a good job, the, sh the Super Fang and Heat Wave. Got a lot of damage. Oh, that was easy. Anyway, there's only ice here. We're taking off. There is a Sfeel. Gonna catch it because it could be good for the team. Oh, I gotta be careful, gotta be careful. I haven't got many balls left. Sleep powder. I'm gonna kill it if I attack it, so I'm just gonna do this. Go back to sleep. Right, come on. Please get caught. Please get caught. Please get caught. Nice! Alright, so when this egg hatches, we can put it on the team. What's this? Uh, Galelite. Okay. Alright, so our team is pretty much done now, then. Unless we find something really cool we want to add. But we need to get to the Volcano Mountain now, I guess? What happens if I go down one of these holes? Can I even go down a hole? Uh, I can find out in a second. Where even is this? Oh! Well, that worked. How do I get onto... Wait, where am I going? It's not a way out. Is there? Am I going crazy? Am I trapped in here? I can't. There's got to be a way to get onto that bit there. Oh, like that, yeah. <laughs> I was struggling so much to get onto that whole bit. <laughs> well, at least we got that. Uh, that's what I mean, like, ice puzzles. Sometimes I can just instantly do it. It's the easiest puzzle in the world. I'll look at it and I'll be, str I'll be struggling. But then you get the hardest one in the world and I'll accidentally do it first try. This always happens. Probably might buy some repels for the volcano bit, I think. But there's nothing else around here. So this would be a great place to end this part off. I think, yeah, we probably want to go to the volcano area next. Or we want to go... Yeah, we either go to Mount Dragon, explore that, and then we'll go to Route 9? Flower... I haven't been to Flower Park either, so we should go there. Check that out when we go back to Crowsville to go left. I think Route 9 was a little bit to the south, like close to the, uh, the way to Route 8. I don't know, we'll find out. But thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.